a film I watched recently on Shudder, which is an add-on to Amazon Prime for a couple of extra bucks if you have Amazon Prime, or it's a standalone subscription service that streams uh, horror content, horror movies, horror TV shows, on and on, horror documentaries. Uh, it's a film from 2017 called Mayhem, starring Steven Yoon, who you may know from as Glenn from Walking Dead, and Samara Weaving, who you might know from um, well, a lot of recent stuff, put it that way. Uh, this is a film that, strangely timely, watching it all of a sudden, the current situation that we're in, it's about a virus, highly infectious virus called the red eye virus that's going around that basically makes people, um, it's, I don't know if I would say lose their inhibitions or basically give in to their most uh, immediate instincts. So if you get angry at somebody, you want to take them apart. If you are interested in somebody, you want to take their clothes off and go right at it. Um, so basically a bunch of people are in an office building, which is a very cutthroat uh, corporate type structure, uh, much like the pagoda in Game of Death in some ways. And uh, an outbreak is there. So the CDC or whoever in the hazmat suit surrounds the building and tells everybody you're in quarantine for X amount of hours. And while everybody is in there, the outbreak spreads like crazy. And it's just an insane amount of violence and backstabbing and, and making out and who knows what. Yoon is a guy who has a vendetta against a coworker and he's trying to get to that top floor to uh, seek vengeance or forgiveness or whatever from the board who's sequestered in the penthouse. Yeah, Weaving is a woman who has been denied um, extension on her mortgage or a loan by this company and she's got her knives out for them too. And basically they're back to back with the best weapons of death you can get in an office and they just basically slash and burn their way to the top floor. I really enjoyed this movie a lot. Very reminiscent of a movie called The Belko Experiment, which came out right around the same time that I didn't like. Um, that was a film about this weird experiment where they're basically everybody in an office building is forced to comply and or just take each other out. That one was very mean-spirited and nihilistic and, and nasty and, and unpleasant while being a comedy to me. Mayhem operates on much the same level, but for whatever reason, I was really into it. It's like slyly funny, it's super gory at times, it's badass, and you just kind of, you, you cheer these two people along as they're <laughs> laying waste to their former coworkers to get to that top floor. Um, it's very over the top, it's kind of cartoony at times, but um, I, I, I had a really good time with this. You know, your mileage may vary on how much bloodshed you dig as far as a, in a horror comedy. Um, I, I don't know really if I would call this a horror movie. It's more like just an extremely violent comedy or an action movie. There are action sequences at times that are pretty well choreographed for what this movie is. Um, but I would highly recommend this. It's, uh, it's out now, I believe it's been out on physical media for a while. I don't know if it's out anywhere other than Shudder, but Shudder is the way I saw it. So from 2017, if you wanna see office-based, virus, contagion-based, bloody comedy, Mayhem fits the bill.